but you are going to sit in partner base do math with someone and after math with someone what you are going to do can somebody tell me yeah santosh disperse disperse then math alone math alone time so you are going to do the math alone time next you go for basic math where the problems will be written by samya and you will be working on it with your partner pairs is that clear yeah yes makes sense okay let's see stuff yeah in math note section yeah note section Oh, I'm very sorry. Thank you so much, Akshay, for reminding me. Guys, can you put on the knowledge and the skill which we are learning in the classroom? I want you to fill in this. Like you can talk to your partner and decide in which you can put it up. Uh, before I start with the objective, I want someone to explain me what is a variable, what is a constant. And what is an expression? Okay, example of a variable. The x. Okay, that is a variable. Okay, thank you. Uh, JP, can you explain what is a constant? Quickly, we don't have time. Constant means number. Constant means numbers. Thank you, JP. What is an expression now? Yeah. Um, Mohan Priya. Variable and constant. Variable and constant together that makes an expression. So today our objective is we will be able to translate the given statements into algebraic expressions by <coughs> visualization. Uh, I have already told you algebra means what? Algebra is what in math? Yeah, Adi. Yeah, Adi. Yeah, Adi. Okay, so language of math through which we speak. Okay, so here. When do we speak sentences when you want to say something? So here they are going to give us some sentences and we are going to convert it into number. math form. Okay, like an expression which has both a number and a variable. That's what we are going to try and do. Okay, uh, so that's what translate meaning change or convert. We are changing a word in English into an expression. Okay, how are we going to do? The same steps that you use, the given and to find needs to be written. The rules I have put. Okay, why those rules are? Uh, like, this is a simple sum which I'm explaining. But these rules will be helpful when we're going into more complex problems. Okay, every, okay. Um, how many of you know what is the subject? I'm shifting to grammar. So, let's do a bit of a grammar. Uh, subject means what? Can somebody tell me? Bala wants to try? Yeah, Bala, try. Subject means? Max, English. No, that is not. That's a subject, but that's not a subject which I am looking for. Yeah. Mani Maran? Wait. In sentence, what are warm? What are? Warm. Whom? Uh, whom? But there's a difference. Like, there are a lot of what and whom. Anybody else? Who can Person. Okay, any person, okay, uh, person, Mani yeah. Maren per is a friend of Karthik. In this, what is the subject? Common noun means he. I'm sorry, okay, let, let me explain. Can you sit down? Like, let me explain subject verb. Oh, take, sit down. Okay, so I, when I say a statement, Mani Maren is a friend of Karthik. Who am I talking about? Who is the very important person I'm talking about? Okay, the line is about the way. We are talking about Mani Maran. So, Mani Maran is my subject. Okay. And it's a friend. Okay. Of Karthik. So, Karthik is also a noun. A noun can only be a subject or an object. But the noun about whom your sentence is important is your subject. And the other noun, like it's a friend of, I mean, Karthik. So, Karthik can be an object. Okay. So, it's okay if you're not able to do it. With practice, you'll be getting it. So I want you to try and understand. So I try and map to any statements given in your max. What is the subject? What is the verb? What is the 
object and also what is an adjective can somebody give me examples of adjective does someone know what is an adjective think so many people okay i have a black bag black bag okay in this the adjective is black okay what is it talking about bag what is a bag noun so anything that adds something to a noun is adjective okay so it describes also okay adds or describes something about the noun is an adjective so keep that in mind let's try to do this okay it is okay if you're going wrong i'll be coming around to help you so see here in this my problem is add 7 to x this is my problem statement which is given to me i'm trying to write the given we all know what is the given whatever is given you're taking and writing as a given and to find what am i supposed to find the algebraic expression for this statement okay rules i want you to copy down the rules as it is since time is not there i'm not writing the rules now see your work will tell you what operation you are supposed to do your work first step is identify the subject verb and object i have done that okay add 7 to x so in this i am doing something to the variable x so this is who i'm talking about so this is my subject and what am i doing that is the verb adding what am i adding that is an object that is 7 okay um uh, my verb in the rule see uh, operations is given by your verb or adjective okay so what am i whatever operation i am putting here it is told to me by the verb okay so i am going to write 7 plus x my operation is my verb okay first we'll do simple problems then let's go a level above um we'll go to market summon station and booklet i want you to try one more the first thing in they got the last chapter that is algebra in the booklet Translate algebraic expression here. Ah. Which of our sums, you know? I want you to solve three sums with your partner, one sum alone. And in math alone session, we'll move to the next worksheet. Okay? In math with someone, next session which you're going to do, you're going to sit with your partner, try to solve three problems with your partner, which of our you feel is easier. Okay? So, are there any confusions? Three problems, maximum. How many problems? Math alone, three problems. Do you have continuous stations, people? I'll be coming around. So first, identify what is the verb, what is the object, what is the subject. The verb tells you what you're supposed to do. Take away means subtract. Okay, so I'm taking away. And this, whatever is involved with your subject, tells you what is this. One more problem to go. W is added to five. My added is the verb. but after going and coming back take 10 minutes to sit down and solve the problem with your partner 